Here's how to do it. Step number one, import your footage into Premiere Pro by clicking on the file in the top menu, then selecting import, and then choosing your video files. You'll see the imported clips appear in the project panel. Step number two, double click on the clip in the project panel to preview it in the source monitor, located in the top left corner of the screen. Step number three, play through the clip by pressing the space bar or clicking the play button in the bottom left of the source monitor. As you watch, take note of the starting point for your selection. Step number four, when you reach the desired starting point, Press the I key on the keyboard. This sets the in point for your selection. You'll see a marker appear in the timeline at the in point. Step number five, continue playing the clip until you reach the desired end point for your selection. Step six, once you reach the desired end point, press the O key on your keyboard. This sets the out point for your selection. You'll see another marker appear in the timeline at the out point defining the duration of your selection. Step number seven. Now you can drag the selected portion of the clip from the source monitor directly onto the timeline. Just click and drag from the source monitor to the desired location on the timeline and release the mouse button to drop the clip into place. Step number eight. Repeat this process for each clip in your project, selecting the best moments to include in your final edit. Remember, you can always go back and adjust the in and out points as needed by double clicking on a clip in the timeline to reopen it in the source monitor. Imagine you're editing a travel blog and you have hours of footage from your latest adventure. By selecting in and out points, you can quickly identify the most exciting moments, like jumping off a waterfall or trying street food for the first time and create a captivating story that transports your viewers to your destination.